Okay, guys, we have three Chevys we're doing. Got two nice old classics and Paulas, and we have this beautiful Chevelle SS396. This thing is black with white stripes and white interior. And we're going right into the driver's side window, man. As you can see, that rear bench is in great condition, man. This is in great condition. And the headliner is in excellent condition with these bucket white seats. Center console gear shifter automatic. Excellent dashboard instruments. Yeah, it's missing a radio, but I'm pretty sure you want to put in your own if you plan on listening to tunes in here. Nice top, a roof, I should say. Excellent glass from front to back. Dual exhaust. Excellent. As we make our way through, but before we do, here's one Impala. There's the other. We're going to be back for those two. And those are some nice cars. Love these heritage stripes on these cars, man. Chevy really had it down packed when they did these stripes. Anything to accent the car, like the SS back here on the bumper, really nice. And this comes with some really nice aftermarket rims. American Racing, deep dish torques. Nice shine coming off this car. Really nice car. Really nice car. Didn't find any dings or scratches or dents. This is a true SS right here, man. A true keeper. I wouldn't leave it outside, that's for sure. If it was me, she'd be in the garage with a cover on it. You know, break it out when you need to. Now look at this Impala. This one here is a great fixer-upper. And I'm betting it's got the original engine. And it's mainly looking like it's all original. I'm not sure what size motor is in there, but I see they put aftermarket rims on here. But this thing is a survivor. It's pretty tight in here, guys. So we're gonna get as much as we can on this old Impala. So as you can see with some of the pinstriping is coming off, but all of that is replaceable. If you're into rebuilding or as you can see some of the back end of the car. And this car is a fixer upper. <laughs> Under all that glass, you see six speakers. So somebody was having some type of fun with this car. So like I said, this is a fixer-upper. You know, I was going to say restore, but it looks like this is a solid car. All it needs is some of the tender loving care that you could put on here to bring it back to full life, you know. But I want to say maybe that motor's a 396. It could be a 427. I am not sure, but if you drop a comment looking to find out, I will definitely get into it for you because I don't have the specs with me. And if you're interested in buying, I'll leave you the information to contact either Tom or Pete here at MGM Classic Cars. And it's definitely a super sport. So that much we do know. It's definitely a super sport. If you look at this driver's side, and it's not a bad looking car. It looks great. You know, for the condition that it's in, it looks great. You know. Now, looking on the inside, if you wanted to redo the seats, you could, but everything in here looks great. Headliner, 
both front passenger and driver's seat. Automatic on the floor. And that's definitely an aftermarket rim. I mean, steering, steering wheel, but it's 120 on the speedometer. That dashboard looked like it had been updated. And this car's pretty clean. Like I said, this is basically your fixer upper. If you wanted to get it to like showroom condition, or if not even showroom condition, if you wanted to do something to it to build it up, or you know where it's at if you want it. Took another look at this engine one more time. As we move to this beautiful red Super Sport. As you see, they did a swap in here. Right down to the headers. Everything is clean in here, right down to the battery, man. Everything is clean in this thing. This thing's bad. Beautiful in here. You know. The front end grill is really nice. Nice and clean. Nice and shiny. I like the paint. The badging says 327, but that's been long swapped out on this here beautiful Super Sport. Glass is immaculate. Deep dish rear. Rear glass. for what we can see in that rear bumper. Everything looks to be in order. Fastback glass in the back. Roof is in great condition. Hood itself, excellent condition. Oh, this is a nice car, man. Real nice. Yeah, this is a real nice super sport right here. I love this color of red on here. With the chrome accenting it. Yeah. This one here's a keeper. Put it in the garage and never let it go. It's automatic in the floor, as we can see. Front. Driver's seat and passenger seat are like brand new. That bench back there is like brand new. And as you look at the headliner, <laughs> yeah, brand new. And looking in, I believe this says 110 on the speedometer. But my God, this thing, it smells great in here. Yeah, this Super Sport smells great, looks great. Kind of hard to beat a real nice Chevy like this, man. So as I said before, all three of these Impala, well, the two Impalas and the Chevelle SS are all sitting here at MGM Classic Cars. If you're interested in any, any of them, leave a drop a comment down below. I'll make sure they have all the contact information that you'll need. All right, guys. Later.